Father God, and I ask that you help me to learn and understand from Psalm 72, a song that was penned from King Solomon, the wise king that you've given wisdom to. Help me to apply it in my life in this century that I live in. In Christ Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Amen. Give the king your justice, O God, and your righteousness to the royal son. May he judge your people with righteousness and your poor with justice. Let the mountains bear prosperity for the people and the hills in righteousness. May he defend the cause of the poor of the people and give deliverance to the children of the needy and crush the oppressor. May they fear you while the sun endures and as long as the moon throughout all generations. May he be like rain that falls on the mown grass, like showers that water the earth. In his days may the righteous flourish and peace abound till the moon be no more. May he have dominion from sea to sea and from the river to the ends of the earth. May desert tribes bow down before him and his enemies lick the dust. May the kings of Tarshish and of the coastlands render him tribute. May the kings of Sheba and Seba bring gifts. May all kings fall down before him, all nations serve him. For he delivers the needy when he calls, the poor and him who has no helper. He has pity on the weak and the needy and saves the lives of the needy. From oppression and violence he redeems their life, and precious is their blood in his sight. Long may he live, may gold of Sheba be given to him, may prayer be made for him continually, and blessings invoked for him all the day. May there be abundance of grain in the land, on the tops of the mountains may it wave. May its fruit be like Lebanon, and may people blossom in the cities like the grass of the field. May his name endear forever, his fame continues as long as the sun. May people be blessed in him, all nations call him blessed. Blessed be the Lord, the God of Israel, who alone does wondrous things. Blessed be his glorious name forever. May the whole earth be filled with his glory. Amen and amen. The prayers of David, the son of Jesse, are ended. Wow. So here I am thinking... This was for Solomon who was praying, but it's not. It is his father praying for his son. That is amazing, Lord. How I reminded that I should be praying bold prayers for my loved ones, bold prayers for my children, bold prayers for others, bold prayers for myself, and that I may do your will. Help me, Lord God, to do the righteous gracious, merciful, and just thing because I have a merciful and just God who has compassion on others. Oh Lord, help me to walk and breathe and be more like Jesus so that others can see Christ in me. I pray all these things in my Savior's most precious name, Jesus Christ. Amen.